Mike's mom's birthday. Mom. We are surprising her. Yeah, I, have flowers. I, I, I have the flowers. flowers. I have my flowers. You have your flowers? Uh, way back. Okay. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. Good morning, everybody. Mike and I are in the car and on an epic road trip today. It's another day in which to excel, Jelly. It sure is. We have, uh, it is, my head's a little bit of a whirlwind. Um, we flew up to Maryland, what, two days ago, had some work meetings yesterday, and now we are in the car and we are driving to Rochester, New York. Special day today. It is a very special day today. It's about a six hour drive. Oh, actually, I take it back. It's six and a half hours without any stops. <laughs> And it is where Mike wants to leave at eight o'clock and look what time it is right now. It is, can you guys see that? Kaboom. 7.58, we are early. Anyway, the reason that we're going to Rochester, New York today, you ask? It is a very special day. It is Mike's mom's birthday. Mom, happy birthday, Woo! mom. Am I allowed to say on camera what her number is? She doesn't care, I don't ah, know. Mike's mom is turning 86 years old, you guys. Celebrate, <laughs> celebrate, celebrate. <laughs> We could not pass up this opportunity to be with her on her birthday. I tell you, make the moments, make the memories. She's gone. She's 86 going on 49. She really is. The woman still mows her own lawn. Mike told me she got, he got off the phone with her the other day. And, you know, it's Rochester, so it's snowy. It's March, right? She just bought a roof rake. <laughs> so this is a this is some type of, of contraption where you can rake the snow off your roof at, at 86 you years old. walking into your house and have the snow Boop. fall on your head. So she takes care of that. Anyway, we are surprising her. I said to Mike, okay, Mike, did you, like, why are you surprising her? Why don't you call her and tell her? <gasps> <laughs> Those are our friends. <laughs> so good to see them. Um, I said, Mike, why don't you just call her and tell her that we're coming? Cause you know, I don't know if you wanna like surprise her what if she's doing something or if we, she gets upset because she had something planned and we have to move around he said you know what jill she's gonna yell at me either way she would yell at me for coming and yell at me for not <laughs> coming or no she would yell at me for telling me that <laughs> i was coming and she would yell she at yells for surprise she, she yells because she loves right because this is the whole thing she's like typically don't come because she doesn't want us to be like dangerous on the road you know what i mean she's like i don't want you to go through the effort i don't want you to do all that that's why she would say don't come how often do you turn 86 that's thing and then if we do surprise her then she's gonna yell at her uh, yell at us for not telling her that we were coming <laughs> <laughs> so either way it's all good and we're so excited yeah, to go love her so much we do and this is the thing this is our goal you guys we've got to get there and surprise her before her birthday's over before her birthday's over <laughs> we gotta so go. here we go we're stopping at the store for real quick first and then we're on our way all right, we just made it into Pennsylvania, and I totally missed filming the sign. They have a beautiful sign, Welcome to Pennsylvania. But um, anyway, we are on our way. We are traveling, what about now? We've been traveling for about an hour? Mm -hmm. yeah? yeah? All right, how much farther do we have to go, Michael? Oh, there's no welcome. Say about 306 miles. <laughs> <laughs> so this is how it goes with Mike. So we're traveling, right? And we're I, on a mission. I know, we're on a mission. But honey, sometimes I need to eat. And you guys, I don't know, you probably know Actually, this about Mike. Eating before we, left the house. <laughs> we left at eight in the morning and we didn't have any food because we don't really live there. So this is the thing. You guys, Mike doesn't eat on a daily basis until dinner time. You probably already know this about him if you've been watching, but he literally fasts until dinner on the daily. <laughs> so he doesn't understand that the rest of us actually need sustenance. Like Brennan, Ryan, Katie, the rowing kids, right? And me, well, I just need a little bit, of, a little nugget, They're a little nonstop. more salt, a little something to keep me over, hold, tied me over. So when, when we're in the car, we're like, Mike, can, can we please stop for food? No, don't eat, you can't eat. We gotta get there, Jill. I understand that. But if, like, you know when you stop and you give the car a little bit of gasoline? You gotta give us yeah, a little bit of food, right? To keep on going. All right, well, we can stop in 294 miles. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what we're filling up for gas? Right, Great, so I get to eat when the car gets to eat? <laughs> Thanks a lot, that sounds Car's awesome. Car's drinking, you're eating. <laughs> exactly. Maybe I'll get a chance to eat. I'm at about a three right now as far as hunger goes. I'm okay. hoping that. So are you going up the scale or down the scale? 
If you don't well, eat, will you be at a 10 eventually? Or yeah, will you be so at one eventually? I'm going to a 10. So I've got about seven, seven, notches. seven notches until I'm absolutely famished and can't function. So a 10 is you're going to pass out. Exactly. <laughs> I'd like to not get to 10. If we could eat somewhere before uh, or around when my stomach starts growling, that would be good. That's about a seven and a half. Seven and a half. Yeah. All right. Let's work yeah. on it. Okay. Three hours later. Hallelujah, Michael Donna, Michael John, Michael Donnelly. We are stopping at the Sheets right here in Central Pennsylvania. What number are you? Uh, I'm at about a five right really? now. So yeah, it's creeping up there. So it's nice to get it before it gets to a seven, and I get really hangry. Get you some food. Yes. Do you want anything? You are not gonna eat any food, are you? <laughs> Probably not. All right, you guys, let me go see what I'm going to eat. Probably some type of hard-boiled egg, maybe Ew. some cheese. I might get a hoagie. What time Ew. is it? 10.22. Is it too early to get a hoagie? <laughs> I might. I was craving, like, mayonnaise, tomato, lettuce, something like that. So, yum, 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 yum. All right, you guys, this is my favorite thing to do. I love it. Ready? Here we go. Cold sub. Classic turkey. Half sub. No thanks on all the fried. Yes on the white. No on the toasted. Yes on the provolone, no on the extra, yes on the mayonnaise, light mayonnaise, continue, thank you, uh, yes, pickles, tomatoes, lettuce, continue, continue, extra turkey, no, no thanks on the fried stuff, and there we go, boom. This is Mike mad because I'm taking so long. <laughs> Gross. My lunch, a turkey and cheese sub, and a bottle of water. Mike's lunch, a large Diet Coke. <laughs> okay, you're supposed to not eat until dinner, and then you choose to eat that? That's disgusting. You're gross. On the road again. I can't wait to get on the road again. Seeing places that I've never been. I'm not sure that's how it goes. I can't wait to get on the road again. <laughs> So we decided that we better call Mike's mom because she doesn't know that we're coming. And if we don't call her for her birthday, she'll be like right. suspicious, right? So here we go. Gotta sing, sing loud and proud. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> and take your call right now. Please do the message. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Helen. Happy birthday to you. Today's a special day. Woo! Happy birthday, Helen. We hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day. And hopefully we'll see you soon. <laughs> Bye. We love you. Oh, maybe I'll see you soon. Maybe I won't. I am so terrible at um, at surprises. Actually, I'm good at surprises, but I'm I get all nervous. You know what I mean? But hopefully, she is none the wiser. We're in the car. We could be in the car anywhere. She doesn't even know we're in the car. Right. Maybe she hears like on the message, but it's okay. So anyway, um, hoping we can pull off this surprise. I know. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. So we are now, how far are we into our drive? We have only uh, three hours and 23 minutes left. Okay, so we're almost halfway there. Ah, yeah, that's exciting. Yeah. And so far it's been delightful, other than the potential starving. We're good travelers together. We are good together. I think that bodes well for us being empty nesters. Mm. Which, by the way, I was going to say this the other day. I don't think we'll actually ever be empty nesters. Like, the kids have gone away to college, but I would say we see Katie, at least Katie, we probably see her every three weeks. Yeah. Because she, you know, wants to come home, or she wants us up there, whatever. And that's all good, it's all good. I That makes me very happy. Um, so I don't necessarily think that empty nesting, at least my initial 
thoughts are that I don't think empty nesting is gonna be as detrimental as I thought it was gonna be. Cause I don't really think it's gonna, I mean, they might not live at home, but we'll see them all the time. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I do. And it's not so bad hanging out with you. Really? Uh-huh, I kinda like it. <laughs> Little pit stop. Let's go. All right, how long we have, you guys? One hour left. Mike's making a little pit stop. That Diet Coke, I guess, got to him. All right, pulling into the Wegmans. Woo! It's a staple in Rochester. Rochester, you have to say that with you, Rochester. That's right. All right, what are we getting, Mike? Six hours and almost 10 minutes. Fantastic, that's perfect timing. Another safe so, jelly. flowers and birthday hats? Let's do it. All right. Michael John, what are we gonna do if we go to your mom's house and she's not there? Uh, that's probably pretty likely. Um, <laughs> and what do we do? We'll go where we, where we think she is. We'll just chase her around town. <laughs> <laughs> what if you she... find her someplace that you're not happy right. with? Right, mother. What if she's here in the grocery store? Right. Wouldn't that be Wouldn't fantastic? That, that would be hysterical. Can we please get some chocolate chip cookies? She likes chocolate chip cookies. Almost as much as I do. Ooh, how pretty. Five ten? Yes. I don't think that's enough. They're gorgeous. Need bigger ones, I think. Oh, maybe. They're very pretty, but they're little. Okay. Worthy of a mommy bird. That's right. Eighty-six years. She gets big flowers. Oh, that's much better. Oh, I like the ones with the orange roses. All right. I mean, I guess that does too. But you can hold one. I'll hold one. We're you gonna give her two? Why not? It's so nice, yes. yes. And chocolate chip cookies. <laughs> We're not exactly sure they're gonna have birthday hats here because at most grocery stores they don't. Wait, oh, wait. No hats, lots of birthday stuff, no hats, okay. Let's see, birthday hats. Birthday hats. Our grocery store at home does not sell birthday hats. That's always the problem because we're big birthday hat people. But you usually have to go to like a, a party supply store to get birthday hats. But it would be amazing if they had them here. And I don't see them. Like I can see all the other stuff. Come on, people. You know, you guys bring birthday hats back, man. Nobody wears birthday hats anymore. We love birthday hats. They're so festive. I'm gonna start a hashtag bring birthday hats home back. Mm, Mikey. Okay, well we kinda figured, right? Is there a, um, do you think there's a party store nearby? Like a party city or anything like that? How about a balloon? Let's bring her a balloon. Okay. There's a little balloon. Okay. Oh yeah. Birthday balloons. There's a, oh that's a pretty polka dot one. That's Which very one? pretty. This one? Yes, let's get it. Want me to do it? Yeah, got it. Pretty and polka dot and pink and gold. That's fantastic. She's gonna love it. Yay! We got it! Oh, she's gonna be so happy. She's gonna yell at you and then she's gonna cry. <laughs> That's what's gonna happen. Next up, Nani's house. Look at the snow, Michael John. Wow. Holy cow. If, if there's still that much here, there must have been a ton. Wow. You know? All right, we are here. We are not sure she's here. She does not look like she's here. Okay. But we're gonna give it a try. Just hang out here? No, it's cold. Okay, we're gonna be frozen when she gets Exactly. Out. She's gonna get over four in the morning. Right. Well, <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> well, it is her birthday. Right. She's well, allowed to be. Okay, so that didn't work. She's not at her house. Hmm. So she could, we're thinking of all the places that she could be. Mike just called his sister and she does not know where her mom is. So now we're looking around. She possibly could be visiting her friend at the assisted living. So we're driving around the parking lot of the assisted living looking for a car. No, I don't see it here either. Hmm. I don't think she's here. What could she be? Now Mike has two more sisters. Maybe we should call your other sisters too. Hmm. Find out where she is. Do, 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 do. What if she we came all the way up here and right? she decided that she was gonna go down? <laughs> Oh yeah, I went to Niagara Falls for the weekend. <laughs> <laughs> like what? <laughs> all right, stay tuned. We hope we find her. We have all this good stuff for her. We want to surprise her. We want to take her to dinner. Right. We're gonna do all this good stuff. So take this as a note, you guys. If you it fits your birthday, make yourself available be to home. be surprised. <laughs> exactly. Be, be home. home. <laughs> and if you're a grocery store, please stock your shelves with birthday hats. All right, we're back at the house. <laughs> I'm not sure what we're gonna do next. Mike's talking to his other sister, Jackie. 
Oh, she, she just called her. She's on her way home. <gasps> She's on her way home. We're, How wait, long? Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, we got. We can't be in the bar in the driveway. No. No, 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 no. We have to be. We have to be hidden and then pull up. Oh, really? Yeah. Because then she'll she'll wonder who we are and then is yeah. Okay, bad. Okay, back up. Didn't have her answer. All right, now we're all, we're all nervous. I don't know. We're not sure what we should do. Should we be in the driveway when she comes up? Because then we'll be able. Like she'll she'll approach us. I think it's more of a surprise when you approach the person. So I don't know. But she also might pull into her driveway and then into her garage. If she does that, then we'll have to like knock on the front door. Maybe we should do that, Michael. Yeah. Let's wait till she pulls in the driveway in the garage and then we'll knock on the front door. She's gonna. I think she's gonna pull in and then put the garage door down. Right. And then we'll just wait and then we'll go knock on her front door. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay. And I'm losing juice in my phone to you guys, so we might not even be able to get this whole reaction. <laughs> Alright, I feel like we're casing the joint out. That's our house right there. We're just sitting over here. Waiting in the car. Got her flowers. There's a link. what it must be like to be a private eye. Are right, you guys, she's pulling up. She's just behind that lady walking dog. She's getting her mail. She's getting her mail. This lady probably thinks we're... Hi, if so, if thinks we're oh, she doesn't. Hope the I, dog doesn't start barking at us. I know, I know, I know. And I'm filming too, so she's probably like, what is going on? I got, I got to stop filming now. Shoot. Closes? There she goes. Look at you guys, that's her right there. Oh, she's backing in. Mm -hmm. She's very good at that. Yeah, back in here. Yes. She, she doesn't even know we're here. She has no idea. And we have the flowers, right? We do. We've so got should the flowers. We just, maybe, maybe, her... maybe, 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 maybe. Maybe, wait, wait, yeah. wait, wait, wait. I'm That's... so nervous. Wait, let her back in, let her back in, let her back in. Wait, we gotta okay. have the flowers. All right, all right. I have Get the flowers. Back. I have my flowers. You have your flowers? Uh, way back. Okay. All right, you guys, I hope that my... <laughs> Ah. Oh no, okay, oh no, around, okay, okay, okay. No, no, she's getting out. Okay, all right. <laughs> so, wait, we're going in a circle now? And then we'll go knock on her door? Is that what we're gonna do? Okay. Thank goodness she showed up. <laughs> oh, my gosh. oh, we are a mess. That was terrible. I hope the surprise is much better than what just happened. All right, we've pulled into the driveway now. It is, we'll it is totally fun to do this. She has a ring, so she might see us by now. When did we see her last? I'm not sure. Her. It has been a bit. Okay. So you say surprise. Okay, hold on. Wait. Say happy birthday. Okay, hold on. All right. Yeah, action. What girl? You, you get in, you get in. You, you get closer, get closer, get closer. Get closer. <laughs> <laughs> so you start singing happy birthday? Let's first sing a happy birthday. I think, I hope so. Happy birthday, Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear mom. Happy birthday to you. Oh, see, I told you she was going to cry. I knew she was going to cry. Don't give her the flowers. Hey, Dan. Oh, is Dan here? Hi, Dan. See the door come down. Yeah. We knew you were on your way home. <laughs> yeah. oh, happy birthday, mommy! Yay! Special day today. Happy birthday, mom! We couldn't miss it. It's a big day. Here, hi, Dan. Oh, we brought you flowers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's crying. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna turn it off. <laughs> oh, the, the luckiest woman, woman in town. Woman we know, yeah, exactly. The, the richest. The richest. The richest woman in, in town. town. Woo! There's Aunt Jack and Uncle Dino. Hi, guys. Yay! It's a party. Okay, huge success. We're on our way back to the airport. Uh, Helen, Mike's mom, said that this birthday was her best birthday that she can remember. Right? Love it. She probably cried 10 times. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody called. She got tons of flowers. It was absolutely amazing. If you guys want to see when we surprised my mom, these moments are amazing. I love doing surprises. When we surprised my mom for her birthday, take a look at this video and see you guys later. Bye.